Hey, what's good, guys? So, I have to share with you some stuff on here to make things a little easier. So, check this out. Whenever you get... Let's turn this up. Don't save. Whatever. You shut it down. Turn it on. So, whenever you turn on your Akai Force, you're going to have to think of a different nickname for this thing. I'm thinking like the X-Force or something. I don't know. But I had a question from a subscriber, like, where do I find my, my sounds? Where is everything? And it is a little weird to navigate around. If you go to Empty Project, and what the first thing that I see, right, it shows you your, your mixer. I go up here to plug-in, and then you're going to hit load. That's That's like... On the MPCX, you hit browse. On this, you hit mixer, plugin, load. And then, you know, you got all your instruments and audio clips right in here. Um, this only comes with these different engines right here, but it does have all these different samples and stuff too that you can just use there. What's really cool is like the hype engine. You select it. You can only select one sound for that instance, but you can go back to the mixer and add as many tracks as you want. So let's add another one. And it, and it just keeps... It's You can go all the way up to 16 tracks, I believe. So that's pretty, pretty cool. Um, so back onto this plug-in here, how we get to see it. It's like, where's my plug-in? So what you're going to do, follow me on this. So when we, when we got to our home page, we had plug-in. So now we're going to select that track. We're going to hit load. Select which plug-in we want. Select which sound we want. We're going to hit menu. And then track edit. Okay. Track edit will take you back to the screen that you you want to go to to see your plugin. So that's how you see your plugin on each track. Um, let me see here real quick. On the bottom, let me show you here. On the bottom, you can go in between each track. You hold it down. You hold this one down. It'll change. For each plugin that you have, so I think that's pretty dope too. Set you back up here. All right, so and it's got a lot of presets in there. I was just wanting to show you how to get into your plugins, because for me it was kind of a your 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 Akai Four starts up like this. You add a track, whatever kind of track you want. Say you want a, a plugin. Or say you want a drum track, you go to your drum track, you hit load, you know what drum ca uh, track you want. Menu, track edit, there's no like drum thing on here, like a, uh, you can stack your sounds and all that just like the MPC guys, you know, you're going to love this and the effects, um, you can see them. So it's really, really cool. I want to go over how to use the knobs on uh, one of my next videos because you have to learn how to use these knobs in order to get the full potential of this device. So, uh, But for this one, I'll, I'll run down one more time. I'm going to start. Don't save. It's going to be a brand new project. And this is just the answer to the fact, uh, the question was, how do I see my instruments in here? How do I see my stuff? And it starts you off like this, audio plug-in. Let me get you in here for a better view. One second. Okay, that should be all right unless we fall. Okay, so here's my plug-in. This is how it starts load whatever you want instrument hype 
select the sound. That's the sound we have for six. Go back to menu, track edit. That's the engine that we have. So that's how you see your sounds. Okay. Again, my name is Pauly Popo. I just wanted to share this video to make things a little bit easier. I do have the uh, Ableton link going on. I'm going to post a video about that. I have it synced up with my uh, MPC uh, X, and it's pretty cool. You can see that they are both linked together. So, yeah. We'll see what happens, and uh, thank you guys very much.